It was a night like any other, a festive club filled with laughter and fun. But as we all know, it would be a night that would always be remembered. February 20th, 2003. The aging rock band Jack Russell's Great White performed at the station, a small roadside nightclub in the old New England mill town of West Warwick, Rhode Island. The show began with fireworks, 15 foot blasts in a club with 12 foot ceilings. A trickle of flame crawled up the wall. Moments later, columns of fire. In seconds, the stage and then the club became an inferno. 100 killed, hundreds hurt. The deadliest single building fire in modern American history, the nation's deadliest rock concert. As families mourned their dead and burn victims struggled to survive, the questions were overwhelming. Was this an accident or a crime? The nightclub had passed government fire and safety inspections. Why did it go up like a torch? Jack Russell and Great White claimed they had permission for fireworks at their shows and had no clue they were dangerous. A federal investigation recreated the disaster in a lab and showed deadly black smoke took the lives of those inside just 90 seconds after the fire started. No time for everyone to escape. Were there too many in the club? In the panic, there was a stampede toward one exit causing a bottleneck. Why not use the other three exits? The government pointed fingers and filed criminal charges, but those accused did not include Jack Russell and his bandmates. For survivors and families struggling to recover, there seemed to be no justice. And in the end, there were never any trials, not criminal, not civil. That meant the government's version of events was never vetted in court. People think that the legal system is a search for the truth, and it is not. It's a search for a result. A result that left unanswered questions. See, the story of the Station Nightclub fire is the story of loss, but it is also the story of the triumph of the human spirit. First responders rushing to the scene, strangers risking their own lives to pull each other out of the smoke. Now, a fuller explanation of what happened has emerged. Key figures have shared what they know for the first time. A story of people put through a crucible, of survivors, heroes, victims, villains, of a system that's supposed to be there to protect us.